Welcome back to Good Morning Northwest. Beautiful spring weather comes with more people getting outside on the trails and pathways. The Benton Franklin Council of Governments is looking for people with thoughts on the current bicycle networks in the Tri-Cities. Riley Fitzgerald joins us live now in studio. Good morning, Riley. How can people get involved with this plan? Good morning, Jessica. The Benton Franklin Council of Governments is working on the development of a regional bicycle plan. This means they're looking for feedback on a couple of different areas. First, the barriers to biking in the Tri-Cities, then desired connections around the region, and frequently traveled routes. The council is then going to work to fill those gaps. We're doing a current infrastructure analysis, so looking at all of the region's facilities, whether that's bike lanes or bike paths, seeing where there's gaps, identifying those gaps, and then helping jurisdictions see where they can get funding to fill in those gaps. Benton and Franklin counties currently have 44 miles of trails in urban areas. While there's a lot of recreational biking, the Council of Governments is hoping to see more commuting via bicycle. I spoke with Aaron Breich about the regional bike plan meeting that happened last night in Richland. He says it had just about record attendance with around 30 people who showed up to participate in the discussions. He says there's different levels of cyclists in the community, all with different goals and ideas for the council to consider. He also included that it was good to hear perspectives from people who use bikes as their only mode of transportation. If you're interested, there is one meeting left in this kickoff series for the regional bike plan. It's tonight from 5 to 7 o'clock at the Mid-Columbia Kennewick Library. So we have done an active transportation plan in the past. We are splitting it into two documents now. So this year we're doing the regional bike plan, and then next year will be the regional pedestrian plan. So this year is the uh, bike plan. We're holding a kickoff series for people to be able to give their input at the very front of the planning process rather than, say, during the middle or the very end. Once the Council of Governments has its initial feedback, it's going to make a working group and then release an official survey in May. With that official survey and feedback, the plan will be developed throughout the summer. A draft should be completed by October, and according to officials, the plan will be adopted by the board in December. Next year, the Benton Franklin Council of Governments is also going to start working on a regional pedestrian plan. Stay tuned for more details as we get closer to that. In studio, I'm Riley Fitzgerald. Jessica, I'll send it back to you.